More than half the football universe is willing Lionel Messi to go ahead and win the World Cup in what looks like his final attempt, but that only means that more than half the footballing universe might be in for a huge disappointment before the year is out. Before the kickoff of the tournament in Qatar, Argentina were one of the favourites to win the World Cup, but right now, well, not so much. And we may all have to start making peace with the fact that Messi will not win the 2022 World Cup. And here's why. First of all, that first game against Saudi Arabia was certainly not a good way to start the tournament. Saudi Arabia was supposed to be the easiest fixture in the group, and Argentina ended up squandering a lead as well as many chances to allow the Middle Easterns to successfully pull off one of the biggest upsets in football history. But to be honest, it isn't so crazy to think that Argentina could still make it out of the group. The question is, how much farther will they go with that type of lacklustre performance? Let's even take a break from the performances on the pitch. The stars honestly don't seem to be aligning for a perfect last dance for Messi. In just the first game of the tournament, their 36-game unbeaten streak, which stretched all the way back three years, has snapped. That surely is not very auspicious for Messi, who really wants to win the trophy. Another thing that's not looking like a good sign? His golden boots. No, we don't mean the multiple golden boot awards he's won across his career, we're referring to the ones on his feet. Against Saudi Arabia, we saw Messi step out in the gold custom-made Adidas X-Speed Portal Leyenda which was inspired by the boots he wore in his first World Cup outing back in 2006. Pretty poetic that he's going full circle, isn't it? But those boots could really end up being his undoing. Why do we say that? Well, golden boots have not exactly given much luck to their superstar wearers at the World Cup. In 2006, Zinedine Zidane wore a pair of iconic golden boots in the final against Italy, and need we remind you what happened in that game. Not only did Zizou lose the final, he was sent off on the last game of his professional career. Remember, before the tournament, Zidane declared that it would be his last World Cup, just like Messi declared before this tournament that this will be his last World Cup. Hmm it even gets closer to home because when one of Messi's closest friends Neymar had the worst World Cup match of his life, he was wearing golden boots. That game against Colombia in the quarterfinal of the 2014 World Cup, which marked the end of the tournament for Neymar, is surely one of the most traumatizing football games that Brazil number 10 has ever played in. He was very nearly paralyzed as his doctor said and it just so happened that he had a pair of golden boots on his feet that day and Messi stepping out for a game everyone expected him not just to win but win easily in a pair of gold boots and going on to lose is surely not a good sign, especially when you put the antecedent events into consideration. Speaking of antecedent, Messi has never scored in a World Cup knockout game. That's in four attempts. Even in the 2014 edition, when they made it all the way to the final, he didn't score in any of the knockout matches. So if Messi, Argentina's best player and the man the entire country looks up to, can't score in the biggest games of the tournament, how then can Argentina possibly win the competition? Finally, one thing we all have to make peace with, no matter how hard it may be, is that Messi is nearing the twilight of his career and cannot carry Argentina on his own again as he was able to do back in 2014. He'll need massive help from his teammates, which he didn't seem to get a great deal of in that game against the Saudis. But don't get it wrong, we really do love Messi and we're wishing him the best at this tournament. The aim of this video was not to kill the hopes of his fans around the globe, but just to wake everyone to the reality of things. Anyway, what do you think? Are you still of the opinion that Messi can win the 2022 World Cup? If yes, tell us why you think so. We'll be going through the comments. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Also, turn on the bell notification so you never miss out on new content and we'll catch you in the next one. Bye-bye.